it is now our time to turn attention to Dax Milne, who has ascend ascended to bona fide offensive star for this BYU offense. Precision route running, great hands, leads the Cougars in receiving yards. Yet he's just still Dax, and it remains low-key. One-on-one BYU Sports Nation, all access with Dax Milne. Dax, there have been so many unforgettable, memorable moments during the 2020 football season for BYU thus far. If you had to pick one as your favorite, what would it be? Oh, man. Favorite moment. Um, I think for me, it was just the first time that we were able to have fans at Houston and at home. I think it was my favorite moment, just seeing Cougar Nation just out there. It's uh, It was fun. It certainly brings a different energy, that's for sure. Uh, the fact that you are roommates with Zach Wilson comes up often on broadcast. Not as often as Zach's trips to California come up, but it still comes up quite a bit. What's life like in an apartment with Zach Wilson during football season? During football season, well, football does not end after practice. Um, it definitely carries over when we get back at the house. He's He's on the phone talking to coaches or his dad. And it's just sometimes I'm like, Zach, just let's just take a break from football for a sec. But um, after that, then it's all fun. You know, we mentioned we play ping pong and just watch movies and stuff. There's only one thing that slows it down, right? The Bachelorette. Right. <laughs> yes. <laughs> <laughs> naturally, naturally for a guy yeah. like Zach. All right, Dax, when I say number nine BYU at number one or number 21, rather, Boise State, what's the first thing that goes through your mind? Uh, rivalry. That's the first thing that goes in my mind. Um, you know, rankings don't really uh, mean much to me. I just know that they're a great, great team. We're a great team, and I'm just excited for it. What memories do you have of the 2018 game that came down to the last series, ultimately BYU losing that game 21-16 when uh, you and Zach were freshmen in 2018? Yeah, uh, that that game is is it's it stings because I hate thinking about it. Um, I mean, I didn't have too much of a contribution in a freshman year in that game, but um, I know I know Zach Zach did and and. It, I'm sure he thinks about it a lot, and so it'll it'll be good. How much do memories like that impact your emotions and preparation going into a Friday night showdown like this? Yeah, uh, I mean, I don't think about it 24 seven, but like you know, there's times where you where it crosses your mind, and it and it just um, I think it just kind of changes uh, my mindset a little bit, and just. Uh, you know, gets me extra focused, whether it's just doing film or, or out there on pra in practice. Just a, It's a motivating factor. When you look at the 2020 season and see 7-0, and top 10 ranking, and clearly there has been a step forward as a BYU football team from the previous two seasons of going 7-6, and six, what has made the difference? Mm. Yeah, the biggest difference, I think, is just um, – off season and then and during the season uh, just focusing on being a consistent team and and just eliminating uh, mistakes that are just easily avoidable and because in the past like we've been a good team it's just there's just been some just some small things that we needed to fix and I think we're kind of getting a hold of that uh, now and just building on it. BYU junior wide receiver Dax Milne with us on BYU Sports Nation. When Boise State uh, is in the rankings and on the blue. Obviously, the nation is going to pay a lot of attention to what they do as a team. But in your preparations for them, what do you know about their specific squad this year? Uh, yeah, on, on, they have an experienced defense. That's the first thing that I notice is when looking at their their depth, um, uh, especially their secondary. They're all if they're not seniors, they're they're either redshirt juniors or or seniors and so I know that they've played a lot of football and and uh, they know what they're doing so uh, I think that we need to um, realize that in uh, and game plan game plan for an experienced defense all right Dax we'll finish with this uh, thanks to election day preparation time is at a premium this uh, week and it's expedited so how do you overcome that uh, yeah it's it's super weird um, but yeah, I think we're just gonna today just 
do what we can and uh, just put our head down and grind as hard as we can. Um, and then Tuesday, just, you know, it's unfortunate, but I think we'll still do what we can, whether it's watching film, get our own lifts in, um, and uh, come, come travel time, we'll be ready to go. Ladies and gentlemen, his name is Dax Milne. He has officially graduated to bona fide star from underappreciated player. Let's give you some BYU Sports Nation karma for Boise State, my friend. We'll see you up in uh, Idaho. Thank you, man. Appreciate you. The karma is transferred. Dax Milne on the Deseret Still First Credit that. Union hotline. Deseret First, you know why we show how.